the risk assessment during the session will just be to be aware of any moving cars in the in the area that was chosen and watch out for the parked cars around obviously we don't want to damage any of the parked cars by the ball hitting the cars or by the client even running into the car so it's just be aware of that and yeah be aware of moving cars obviously we don't want anything to happen to the client during the session the best option is just stop when any moving cars come near us or towards us and then be careful when near the parked ones so again the pattern would have to be really accurate to the person and we'd obviously step away from the cars if we got too close the best option well the option i decided was move away from the entrance to the car park obviously because there'll be a lot of cars going in and out so if we move away from the entrance more towards the back of the car park we won't get many cars coming around us and near us so anything we've really got to focus on is the park cars and again i said just make sure that the pattern's accurate that we don't go too close to the park cars in case we risk damaging them or hurting the client and yeah i think that was the best action obviously to move into a, an area where there aren't many cars means we wouldn't have to stop and start the session or move around too much and we could complete it as quickly as possible